All right, what is up, everybody? ADSP 101 here. Welcome to another live reaction uh, for Tekken 8. Uh, this time, we're going to be taking a look at Victor. His trailer came out on November 2nd. And uh, interested in seeing him. You know, he's one of two new characters that is coming to Tekken 8. And um, I believe the second one was Reyna. We're going to be looking at her as well. So you guys be on the lookout for that reaction video as well. So you know that's enough talking. Let's uh let me turn this down because I do not want this phone to start ringing mid mid video. You know, I gotta do this. silent so sorry about that I had to do that all right Peggy 16 let's take a look at this let's see what we're dealing with here les couchers de soleil sur la scène oh French there you go Battle for that croissant. Oh, you're old man. Get ready for the next battle. I don't know who Vincent Castell is. We all know if he's some famous voice actor. Yo, yo, he looked like Hitman from, uh, from fucking Dungeon Fighter. I mean, his playstyle look cool. Don't get me wrong. But I don't know if I'm. I don't know if he's for me. A little dope, I guess. I don't know if I like his play style too much. Like, I can appreciate it from a distance, but as far as me playing it myself, I don't see myself liking it like that. Um, he's... It's two people that he looked like he reminded me of. Noctis and... Who else? I can't think of the other person. I want to say Kunimitsu, but it's... Because with that comma, it looked like, you know, the, the kunai that Kunimitsu uses. So on that note, like, I don't, I don't, I don't really know if I'm feeling his... It's almost like two things. You know what? It is Noctis and Kunimitsu. It's almost like they just fused both of their styles together and they created him. But it's like, I don't know, his, the aesthetic of him is like the way he looks doesn't match the way that he plays. You know what I'm saying? Like it just, hopefully they can make sense out of it for the sake of the story. 
Um, because I think Tekken 8 actually has a story this time, not like that bullshit that Tekken 7 had. Uh, I'm hoping that they can explain, obviously, you know, his background and, you know, what, what, what is this secret service he seems like he's a part of. Like, where did he get all this technology from to be doing all this fancy shit? But... Matter of fact, now that I think about it, I wonder if Nina Williams knows him at all. Or maybe are, are they a part of the same assassins group. Or whatever. That's that's like some something that's interesting. But yeah, like, it's kind of confusing because he's an old man using like technology to tell him. I don't know. So it was about... Something about the way he looks doesn't match the way he plays. But it's clearly uh, Noctis and Kunimitsu inspired. You, know, you can clearly tell. Uh, so they did try to preserve Noctis's um, play style to some degree. Even though he was a guest character in 7, they still, tr they still wanted that represented in Tekken 8. And of course, Kunimitsu as well. So... I don't know if that means we're not going to actually get her later on down the line or maybe she's dead in the story. I don't know. I didn't play the supposed story of Tekken 7. You know, I just didn't care for it. So maybe I'm missing some context. But Kunimitsu and Noctis Lucis Kayum, their play styles is represented with Victor. So, like I said, he's not for me. He's not my play style because I don't like all that extra stuff. Like it comes off very try hardish, you know what I'm saying? And <laughs> I don't know. Like I just, I just never favored that. But his aesthetic definitely confuses me. The way he looks doesn't match the way he plays at all. So I will say that. But with that being said, man, I mean, he looks cool. You know, I like the sword. I like when he uses his uh. A little blade, uh, like a fucking comma. Uh, very reminiscent of Kunimitsu's kunai. Her fight style and, uh, and all that. So, I mean, I'm glad we got somebody new. Hopefully he plays a, a good role in the story. That's all I can really say. So, that was my opinion about Victor. Um, you know, hopefully he makes a good addition to Tekken 8. But, uh, that's it. So... Yeah, thank you guys for watching. Peace. Remember, be humble in victory, be gracious in defeat. Show no mercy in battle. War Warriors Collective. I'm out.